Hello friends and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to show you a very easy way in DaVinci Resolve on how to get rid of the flickering. The reason why it's happening is because of your shutter speed and the Hertz frequency of the light. Some cameras you can do this in the camera and you can dial up or down to get rid of that flickering but actually DaVinci Resolve has a very cool way on how to get rid of that flickering even if you have it in your shot. Let me show how it's done. All right, so I am in DaVinci Resolve right now. This is my clip. If I'm gonna play the clip now, if you look carefully to the light, you will see that it's flickering and it's quite annoying, especially if your client paid you a lot of money to film their wedding. It could be annoying, but it's such an easy fix in DaVinci Resolve. It's quite incredible. Let me show you how it's done. So where to find the deflicker in DaVinci Resolve? It's as simple as going to open effects over here just go to open effects and go to search and just write the flicker and you'll see you'll find it here it's as simple as drag it and put it on top of the clip and you see straight away you see that the image sort of like gets a little bit washed out don't worry you have to go on the right top corner here under the effects right under the effects open effects you'll see the flicker is on if i'll switch it off you'll see that it goes back to normal so what you have to do now here under the deflicker settings you have to go instead of time lapse go and do floral light if i play the clip now you'll see that we got rid of that flickering and if you go to effects over here speed optimization reduce detail motion or limit analysis here restore original detail after the flicker go and click here and you can see how much detail do you want still back in the shot so restore detail to restore maybe i'm gonna go a little bit more just to 0 0.5 i'm not gonna go higher than that because i think the effect won't work let me play it again quite incredible how cool is that and you've got the global blend as well if you want to go and change this but i think uh i think to be honest with you the original settings that davinci resolve provides you work absolutely amazing because this is sort of like the middle ground of course you can go and tweak a little bit and see how it works maybe it works for you better but i tend to even detail to restore i think that zero three works better for me if i'm gonna go and play it again absolute perfection and that's all this is how easy and simple it is and this obviously if you're gonna go here floral light you're gonna go to advanced controls and gonna see how many frames temporal noise reduction bad or small you can go and play a little bit with this options over here if you still don't get rid of that flickering this is where i would go to advanced control but if you would put floral floral light like this and it works fine for you just don't bother to go to advanced controls this is from my own experience from a videographer that actually does weddings so i mean it saved me so so many times and i hope it will save you as well and that's all friends thanks so much for watching hope you enjoyed this video i hope you found it interesting and useful and you got some value out of it and if you did please give this video a thumbs up consider subscribing and i'll catch you guys in the next one take care and happy creation.